Welcome to the 30 day balance with a broom challenge. Let's jump in and get started. Welcome to day five. Ah, oh, you are coming back. Be so proud of yourself for showing up every single day. And I think it's so important to give yourself credit for being here, right here, right now. And I am thrilled. So let's jump in, get started with those stretches. All right, take that broom in the right. Use that left arm, stretch it out into that diagonal. So, so good for us. Opening up the chest. If you stayed after with me on day four, if you have Parkinson's or ataxia, thank you for staying after. I want you to know why some of these exercises are so fantastic for you personally. And I know that it's often easy to get overlooked and I wanna let you know you are not overlooked here. All right, straight up and down. Four more, okay? Lengthening, opening, just combating stiffness. Don't hold your breath. All right, this should feel good. One more, straight up. And then we get to go into my favorites, some arcs, okay? Down around, open up that right rib cage. All right, we need to open everything up. If we have any asymmetries, any kind of lateral trunk flexions, we need to even things out. Two more. This is so good for all of us. One more. Ah. Okay, let's switch hands. Put that broom in the left hand. Stretch out the right into a diagonal. Okay. You know, our actual exercise portion is 25 to 30 minutes. I don't count this usually, just because it's so important to always use it day to day. And I want you to really have a good, you know, time of the actual workout. All right, straight up and down. Really use that right arm to press up on the left to lengthen it, okay? Open everything up. One more. I'm so happy you're here with me. All right, let's do those arcs. Down, around, lengthen the left rib cage, around and down. Okay, use that right arm to help the left arm open everything up. How are we gonna fix our posture if we're so tight, okay? We'll work on strengthening, but we also need to lengthen, open everything up. Last one. My goodness, feels so good. Oh, thank you for joining me today. Let's jump in and get started. Round one, let's jump in. Remember your posture, marching it out. Left leg, march it up and down. Posture, tight abdominals. You can always press down with the right as you lift the left. No pressure. Just working on lifting with quality, tight abdominals and good posture. What we wanna do is go like this, okay? We don't need that though. All right, one more. All right, coordination. Well, not coordination, but arms, okay? And then coordination. We're gonna do some forward rolling over the left leg. So up, around, down, squeeze your right shoulder blade. Up, okay, now both arms are straightening out. 
up, around, down, and we're creating circles, rolling, rolling forwards, straightening the arms, squeezing the right shoulder blade, okay? Now, technically it's both shoulder blades, but we're really targeting that right one. Two more, circling and rolling. Are your abdominals tight? Tight abdominals, I should have told you that earlier. Coordination time. Wow, this is a lot on the brain. March the left while you roll over it. Squeeze. So lift and roll. Squeeze. Lift and roll. Are your abdominals tight? Keep your core straight. Straight, tight. Up, around, down. Okay? Lifting the left, rolling over it. One more. All right, very good. Let's do our posture. Let's go to our ankles, okay? Toes up, toes down, okay? Tight abdominals, good posture. You can always squeeze the butt muscles when you press the toes down. So you can always squeeze. The tricky part is we're never trying to come forwards and squeeze, okay? That is what we're combating. We're extending everything. Two more. One more. Very good. We're gonna do some pull-ups, okay? So, arms are up on an angle. Not in front, not up. Up on an angle. You're gonna go ahead, start with your broom out, I'm sorry, um, and then go ahead and tilt back a little bit. Ready? Pull up and down. Now, try to keep your back straight. I started by arching mine and I should not have done this. All right, try to keep your back straight, okay? Now, we're tightening our abdominals and squeezing our shoulder blades. Tightening the abdominals, squeezing the shoulder blades, okay? All right, so it's like we're trying to bring ourselves up and squeeze. It's trying to be more of a pull-up, okay? Don't do what I do when I arch my back. <laughs> All right, two more. Tight abdominals. Okay, very, very good. Let's try to combine them. Talk about coordination, okay? So start with the broom in and your toes up. This is our start, ready? Toes down, press out, toes up and pull. Toes down and press, toes up and pull. Try not to arch your back, keep your back straight. Try to tighten your abdominals. Elizabeth, too many things at once, try your best, okay? Toes down and press, toes up and pull. Down and press, up and pull. Down and press. Are your abdominals tight? Keep your core tight. One more. Down and press, up and pull. Fantastic job. These exercises are so good for us. Okay, posture, go ahead, take that right leg, march it up and down. Tight abdominals, good posture. You can always press down with the left while you lift the right. Then you're engaging those glute muscles, those three butt muscles. You have a pelvic drop, a hip drop when you walk. That means you really need to strengthen those glutes, those butt muscles. All right, are you remembering your posture? And are you tightening your core? You have two more with me. Tight core, good posture. Very good. Okay, we're gonna roll over that right side. Take your hands up, over, down, Squeeze the left shoulder blade. Now, technically it's both shoulder blades, but really focus on the left. Now, 
Are your abdominals tight? Tighten your abdominals. Roll the arms and squeeze. Roll and squeeze. Tight abdominals. A lot to think about. One more. Very good. Let's try coordination time if you can. Okay, are you ready? Are, we start with our broom at our chest. Lift the right leg and roll over it and squeeze. Roll and lift, squeeze. Okay, so I'll say lift the right leg and squeeze. I'll change my cues. Lift, roll, squeeze. Lift, roll, squeeze. Tight abdominals. Good posture. Lift, roll, squeeze. Lift, roll, okay? Two more, focus on those abdominals and that posture. Fantastic job. If you find yourself wanting to go fast, you're cheating yourself, okay? Focus on quality. Fantastic job, we just finished round one. Round two, you are fantastic. Start with our posture, kick out that left leg up and down. Now, focus on quality. You're tightening your quads. You are tightening the abdominal. You are stre stretching out. You are keeping your shoulder blades back for posture. And if you want, you can press the right. Okay, it's a lot to think about. Focus on quality. Who knew a tiny, tiny move could be so complicated? One more. Very good. Okay, both arms up. Take your left hand, pull it down, okay? Up, and now switch, right arm. Up, left arm, up, right arm. Now, when you pull the left, you really should feel that right shoulder blade squeezing in, okay? Left. Right, now are you tightening your abdominals? Keep your core tight. All right, especially when you pull the left side, the left side of the abdominals, right side, right side of the abdominals. Two more, left, right. Focus on those abdominals, left and right. A lot to think about. Let's try coordination, okay? Arms are up. So kick with the left, bring the left side of the broom down. All right, same leg, right side of the broom. Same leg, so left leg, pull down. Left leg, pull down. Tighten your core. Left leg, left arm. Left leg, right arm. Left leg, left arm. Left leg, right arm. Tighten your abdominals. This is hard. Left leg, right arm. Core strengthening. One more on the right. That is not easy, okay? Oh, ankles. Thank goodness, right? Posture. Toes down. Toes up. Now, posture, abdominals. If you want glutes, butt muscles, squeeze the glute, glutes. You don't have glutes, okay? You got glutes. And press the toes at the same time. Toes and tush is like what I like to say. Toes and tush. Do not compromise your core and do not compromise your posture. Two more. One more. Very, very good. All right, for the arms, we're gonna do side tilts. You're like, please, no, but yes, we are. Okay, bring those hands in, elbows are up. Tilt to the left 
side, so your right elbow is up. Tilt to the right side, the left elbow is up, okay? Tilt to the left, squeeze the abdominals. Tilt to the right, squeeze the right side of the abdominals. Left, squeeze the left abdominals. Right, squeeze the right abdominals. This is really lengthening the rib cage on the opposite side. And this is difficult. Tighten, tilting and tightening. Tilt and tighten. One more. Now, if you're like, how am I gonna do that at the same time? Try, we could do this together. Okay, so start with your arms up and your toes up. Okay, ready? Toes down, tilt to the left. Toes up. Toes down, tilt to the right. Toes up. Down to the left. Up. Down to the right. Okay, tighten your core. Down to the left, tight core. Down to the right, tight core. Down to the left. This is advanced. Toes down to the left. Toes down to the right. One more on each side. Toes down to the left. Toes down to the right. Oh. That is advanced and so good if you're doing it correctly. If you're not doing it, if you're saying, ugh, easy, you may not be doing it correctly. Okay, shoulder blades are back. Go ahead and kick that right leg and down. Posture is back. Abdominals are tight. Really contracting those quadriceps. If you wanna push the left leg, you can. If not, focus on posture abdominals and kicking control all right this is not easy okay if you're doing it correctly contract your core muscles ready contract your core muscles one more contract okay let's go ahead lift those arms up bring the right side of the broom down and then the left side of the broom down. Now, if you need to bring your hands apart, you can do that too. Sometimes that's a little easier. Left, right. Now, are you tightening your abdominals? Tighten the left side. Tighten the right side. Tighten the left side. Tighten the right side. Are your shoulder blades back as well? Posture. Posture, tighten. Okay, last one. Are you ready for coordination? Oh my gosh. Okay, start with your arms up. Just give it a shot with me, okay? Kick the right leg and bring that right arm down, okay? Right leg, left arm. It's the same leg, okay? Right leg, left, right, right, right. Right leg, left arm. Right leg, right arm. Right leg, left arm. Now, remember your, your core. Tighten your core muscles. Tighten those left abdominals. Tighten those right abdominals. Tighten those left abdominals. Two more, right, left. One more. Right, last one, left. Wow, you are fantastic. Congratulations, we finished round two. Round three. Okay, posture, step overs. Left leg, up, over, out, up, over, in. Posture, core, okay? If you have an armrest in the way, like you're in a wheelchair, give it your best shot. This is still really good for you. Tight core, good posture, okay? You're not swinging, all right? Do not swing. 
bad. <laughs> Control it. Okay, one more. All right, this is hard stuff. Side to side, take that left, that broom, reach to the left side of the room, and then squeeze your shoulder blades. Left side of the room, squeeze. Now you should be really contracting those abdominals. You're really working on the right side of the abdominals, even though you're reaching to the left. Okay, squeeze, reach, squeeze, reach, squeeze those shoulder blades, reach, tight abdominals, one more. All right, coordination time. Here we go. We're going to lift that left leg up, over, out, reach to the left, up, over, in, squeeze. Up, over, out, reach, up, over, in, squeeze. Up, over, out, reach, up, over, in, squeeze. Tighten your abdominals. Keep your core tight. Let it stabilize your spine. Up, over, in. One more. Up, over, reach. Up, over, in. <sighs> your shoulder blades getting tired? They might be, mine are. Okay, because they're working overtime. All right, right step overs. So, take that right leg. Up, over, out, up, over, in. Tight abdominals, good posture. Really focus on quality, okay? If you have ankle weights on, quality, okay? Don't let those ankle weights compromise your, um, your form, huh. I can think, okay? Up, over, out. Tight core, good posture. All right, let's go to those arms. Take that broom, the right side of the room. Reach and squeeze your shoulder blades. Reach and squeeze. Tighten the abdominals the entire time. You're working the left side of the abdominals. It's opposite for this. These are stabilizing you. They're preventing you from falling over, okay? Reach and squeeze those shoulder blades. Reach and squeeze. One more. Reach. Huh. Let's try coordination, okay? So, we're doing good. You're doing good. Ready? Right leg. Up, over, reach. Up, over, squeeze your shoulder blades. Up, over, reach. Okay, keep your core tight. Tight core, reach. Up, over, squeeze. Up, over, tight core. In. Up, over, reach. Up, over, in. Two more. Up, over, in. One more. Okay, <laughs> great job. You've been working so hard that that's it for, for <laughs> round three. <sighs> One more round to go. You are fantastic. Let's finish strong. Round four, you can do this. Shoulder blades back. Let's start with a left kick. Kick it up, kick it down, lower it. Tight abdominals, good posture. You can always press the right leg if you want, but don't press and hurt, and, um, pardon me, don't press and fall forwards. You have to keep your shoulder blades back at the same time. So it's a kick, good posture. Two more. One more. Very good. It's not hard, it's not easy if you're pressing because you want to curl. Very good. Okay, <sighs> I 
focus, Elizabeth. We are going to go ahead and hold our arms up. And I love these rainbows. At least I call them rainbows. Take your left arm and bring it down, up, switch, down. Oops, I hit the fan. Switch, down. Now, tighten your core muscles. Tighten the core. Remember your posture. Your arms are straight for large amplitude, big movements. Your chest is open. Your core is tight. This is not easy. It looks easy, but if you're doing everything, it's not. Tighten the core. All right, so tighten those left abdominals up right abdominals, okay? Good posture. Left abdominals, last one. Right abdominals. <sighs> You're doing great. Guess what, only this one and one more and then we're done, okay? So, guess what, we gotta combine them or try our best. So, our arms are up. Kick your left leg and lower the broom to the left. Tighten the abdominals. Now, same leg, left leg to the right. Left leg to the left. Left leg to the right, tight abdominals. Left leg to the left. Left leg to the right. Good, core is tight. Posture, arms are open. Okay, one more on each side. Last one to the left. Last one to the right. Wow. You are fantastic if you're still here. You haven't quit. All right, let's guess what? We get to give our arms a small, small break, work on our posture, kick out that right leg, and down. Now, the good news, this is our last exercise when we combine them. Tight core, good posture, quality kicks, okay? If you want, push down that left leg, but don't let it curl you forward. Okay, quality. Good, good posture, tight core. Three more, two more, last one. Very good. All right, so now huh, we can do this. We can do this. It's one minute left, okay? So shoulder blades are back. Take that broom to the right side. Squeeze the right abdominals. Left side, left abdominals. Right side, right abdominals. Left side, left abdominals. Okay? Is your posture back? Large amplitude. That means big. Especially if you have Parkinson's, everything is big. All right, a few more. To the left, tight abdominals, and the right. Fantastic job. Guess what? Our last one, okay? Hang in there with me. Ah, oh, okay, arms are up. Kick your right leg and bring the broom down to the right. Tighten your abdominals. Ready? Broom goes to the left, kick the right. It's the, always the same leg. Right, right, right leg, left arm. Tighten your abdominals. Keep your posture. Left leg, right arm. I, met, I messed that up. Right, right leg, right arm. Right leg, left arm. I'm sorry about that. Right leg, right arm. Right leg, left arm. Good tight abdominals. Good posture. One more. Ready? Last one. Oh my gosh, you're fantastic. Ah, so, so good. All right. We do have our good morning stretch, but that's kind of an exercise, kind of not. All right, up, around, down. 
30 seconds and then we're gonna stretch it out, okay? Up, around, down. Just think right now, I am so proud of myself. And I love it if you say your name out loud. So I am so proud of myself. That's where you put your name, insert name. <laughs> so I would say, I am so proud of myself, Elizabeth. Give yourself the credit that you deserve because you deserve it. Fantastic job, let's stretch it out. All right, take that broom with your right hand, thumb facing up. Take your left arm, stretch it. Oh, you know what we're gonna do. You can always just start, but I like to explain it to people that are haven't been here in a while or hanging out for the first time, open up and down. Open up that right, um, those right pec muscles. One more, open up and down. Straight up, okay? Up to the ceiling and down. Lengthen, so try to use your left arm to lengthen the right arm. Almost like you wanna reach and punch that ceiling. One more, just one more, okay? Oh, my favorite arcs, okay? Down, around, stretch out that right rib cage, around and down. Up, stretch around and down. Big movements, lengthening, opening that right rib cage. One more. Okay, so important for us. All right, let's switch. Take the broom in the left, use the right, stretch it, and down. Open everything up and down, open, up, and down, open it all up, one more, okay, open everything up, all right, straight up, use the left, lengthen the right, and down, stretch out that left arm, Two. Remember, lengthen, lengthen it nice and big. Two more, don't hold your breath. One more. Beautiful job. All right, down, around, and up. Down, around, stretch out that left rib cage, around and down. Down, around, and stretch. Around and down. All right, opening everything up. So important for us, all of us. Okay, four. Last one. This is beyond fantastic for us. Oh my gosh, you're doing so much good for your body. Ah, ah, great job. Congratulations, you just finished day five. Oh, let's put this broom down and just take that moment, even though you just gave yourself credit. Really be proud, okay? These moves are simple and yet complicated and yet you're only using a stupid broom um, and yet it's so good for you. I am so thrilled that you're joining me. I hope that you're having fun. I hope that you're learning and I hope you're finding benefits. If you are, please press like below because it populates these videos for other people. Spread the love, have others join you because I love that you're here and little steps together we can make some big gains.